apparently and there is a goal at Tamworth 1-0 they lead at the moment against Bright Spartans at home so their form currently only one win in five not dissuading them as the referee for the free kick here is Reese just pass forwards and it's invited Jordan Lydon the ex-Australian under 23 grew out of Perth and here is Richards Sinclair wanted to go from range just off balance as he took that one for about 20 they're back behind him away and it's gathered by Bavos neat little ball to find Nathan Cameron urged to shoot by the travelling fans but instead goes wide to his left hand side for Hudson he puts a crossing ball in now as well Skinner swings and misses and Hughes is the beneficiary as he's able to scamper away long ball lovely ball to Stefan Miles as well who's one on one with the goalkeeper but pushes it so Halkins inside the centre circle and forced even back further to Pond. Long ball going forward up towards the Phillips direction. First contact head on to it was from Waring, but it's fallen safely as well. Andy Williams took the shot. <laughs> Throw in for Hereford in the midst of all that. Skinner and Babos with a little interplay between themselves and then Hayhurst with a no nonsense clearance back downing then sends it straight back to where it came from with a little bit extra as well. Waring need to be careful. Waves away with a penalty. Shouts and Rooney sends his shot over the head of it as well. Backwards to Leiden. Still about 20 yards out from the goal. Uh, attacking to our left hand side. Pushes his one ahead to Skinner who's been played onside. Cross goes in. Good little turn and take by Nathan Cameron. Eventually stabs the sneak. Ball down from Mulls. Just couldn't quite link up with Spencer. Here goes Pond once again with the long ball forward. As here is Phillips making his way inside the penalty area. Phillips will get the shot away, palms away. Boss that stands over the ball. The referee has blown the whistle. The end of this uh, set piece will give you some updates in the National League North as it sends in. Herring with a header away. Big swing and a miss by Skinner. Where Hayhurst loops the ball over the top. But Isaac Sinclair can run on to as the Hereford defence try and flood their way back and curves and try to flood forward with some numbers. Lewis, oh. that's all right. Switch up. Oh. Big save by Pond. And cleared away by Babos. Get out injured as well, coming off with a suspected hamstring injury. As now here comes Hereford. Cissé out towards his left hand side. This is Cowley's going to take the shot. Drags it wide right now. At home to Tottenham Hotspurs against Crystal Palace, which our Twitter admin did indeed call at the start of the afternoon. As Williams tries to go over the top. Cissé has controlled it down. He's onside. Cissé! Massive save! Now giving a little bit of a look at the push and shove that's going on in the six yard box. Babos with the ball in, flicked onto the near post. Over the crossbar in the National League North. It's all happening at Scunthorpe. They're down to 10 men and down on the scoreboard as well. Chester winning 2-1 away from home. As here once again is Alex Babos on the Hereford left hand side. Hughes tries to slide in but doesn't get the contact of the ball on the man. Babos with a cross it out towards the far post. Headed away by Craig Mann. Hopeful strike! And it's fizzed wide. Hold on to this. Hold on to this point. It will be something to go down. Well, here is Mann out on the left hand side in the attacking half at the moment. One more roll of the dice potentially for Curls and Ashton to make that one point into three. Mann with a high cross in towards the penalty area. Spencer uncontested will control it down with his chest. The shot is ricocheted out to Reese Hughes. Closed down before he can even think about getting the shot away. Pushed out to the left hand side once again for Mann. Cross goes into the box. Plug it in. Yes. 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 And she is yes. and scores! <laughs> Chance not wasted this time! 94 minutes on the clock! Curzon Ashton won! Hereford nil! And just as we said, the one chance might have gone. Up comes the captain to head in from close range. No, 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 no. Jimmy Spencer! You can hear what it means to these home fans, how much it will mean to Craig Mann and the backroom staff as well. Before this game, only two home wins from seven attempts since Boxing Day.